Hello everybody. In today's art lesson, we're gonna talk about Romero Brito. This is a Brazilian artist. And today we're gonna draw a self-portrait using his style. So we're gonna start our trip from our school in Fanta Leonor that is located in Mazarón, Murcia. And we're gonna travel all the way to Brazil, which is Romero's British country. It's a long way, so get ready. We're gonna go all the way to South America. But what will you need for this artwork? Well, you'll need a red paper. I'll give it to you in a second. That's the background. Also, you'll need black marker that you have for sure on your pencil case. We need also glue and some scissors. So get ready because we're going to start. So now I'm going to show you how to draw Romero's Brito self-portrait. We're going to start the neck. Then we're going to draw the neck. We're going to do a t-shirt. And we're gonna draw the name of Brito on it. This is color black. We're gonna start making the ears, the nose, mouth, and eyes. We start with the hair, and I'm gonna draw some lines. I'm gonna do another section, and I'm gonna complete it with some round circles. I'm going to do some stripes and I'll end by doing some lines over here. Now I'm going to make the background which is red and now I'm going to show you how to draw a boy. So I'll start with the face, complete it with the ears and now I'm going to draw the neck and the t-shirt. I'll do the same as I did before. I write his life's name, that's Brito. And now I'm gonna complete the t-shirt, also making all the details on the face, like the nose. Now I'm gonna do the mouth. Now I'm moving into the eyes. I'm gonna draw the hair differently. I start by making a shape on the top of the head and I'm gonna complete it. I'm gonna erase that. I'll do it again. And now I'll complete both sides of the hair. I'm gonna make some stripes over here, some lines, some straight lines over there. I'm gonna complete this section with some circles other stripes and some other lines. You can do different patterns if you want to. And now I add the background. Of course, I'll do it by this video, but you can make it using the red paper I just gave you. 